instructions for preparing medical hood type protective masks, super Kesar, and special kits for the elderly, Kesar, for use in an emergency. The special protective kits are intended for the elderly and for young people who are unable to wear a regular mask. They should be assembled now so that they will be ready for use when needed. The kit contains two sealed filters, two bellows, protective hood, drinking tube, waist wraps, and instructions for use on tape or CD. Pick up the blowers and remove the disposable tape safety cover on the side. Press the red button on each blower to activate it. The safety cover must be removed for the blower to work. When the blower is working, you will feel the air being emitted and hear a faint hum. After testing, turn off the blower. Pick up the filters. On each one, pull out the white cover and unscrew the black cap anti-clockwise. Please note, the cap and cover must be removed for the filter to work. Push the filter into the blower. Make sure that the screw aperture on the filter is facing outwards. Push until you hear a click. Now the filters are in position. Two air hoses are attached to the body of the hood. Screw them into the filter apertures. Attach the blowers to the waist straps. The kit is ready to wear only after you have carried out all the above actions for both blowers. Put on the protective kit only when expressly instructed to do so via the media. The blowers must be turned on before putting on the hood. Do up the waist straps, fasten the buckles and pull the straps tight. Operate both blowers by pressing the red button and make sure that they are working. Roll the edges of the inner nylon hood liner up and outwards and put it on from the top of the head downwards. If necessary, ask a family member or friend to help. Position the mask in front of your face and spread the edges of the head covering around your neck and shoulders. Do up the chest strap. How do you know if you have put it on right? If the blowers are working, no condensation will form on the mask and you will feel the air coming out of the opening. At this stage, you are protected. People with special kits for the elderly, KSR, please note. After putting on the protective kit, the forehead band should be tightened by turning the button at the back of the head and turning the two buttons located at the sides of the forehead. Afterwards, tighten the neck strap by pulling the two ends in opposite directions until it fits well. You can drink while wearing the mask. Connect the drinking tube to the mask by removing the tube aperture cover in the mask and screwing in the tube. Put the end of the tube into the bottle of drink, right to the bottom, and put the mouthpiece that is inside the mask into your mouth. In order to drink, you have to squeeze the two handles in the middle of the tube and suck the liquid up through the mouthpiece as if drinking through a straw. Squeezing the handles opens the valve in the middle of the tube, and so it is necessary to continue to squeeze while you are drinking. After finishing your drink, take the tube out of the bottle Remove it from the mask and close the tube aperture in the mask. Detailed instructions can be found in the instruction book. Following the instructions carefully saves lives. It is absolutely forbidden to use the atropine syringe that is in the kit. Use of the syringe could endanger your life. Following the instructions carefully saves lives.